All right, getting the last few things wrapped up. I uh, did get the uh, mortar in, the cement into the rocks, and so this part of the uh, flower bed is uh, secure so we don't have to worry about the dirt washing out when it rains. I can come back and do some touch up and clean up. That's my very first time I've ever done cement, but uh, it's it's in there, it's good. So uh, um, yeah, I'll do a little bit of clean up on that and then uh, that'll be all set, keeping uh, from dirt from washing out when it rains. Then inside, I got all the drywall done, just finished up painting, and drywall took me a lot more time just going back and uh, I'm kind of a perfectionist, which is weird for as unplumb as everything is in here, how I want to be perfected on the uh, smoothness of the drywall. Anyway, so after so many applications of uh, spack one and then uh, sanding, I got it all smoothed out. And I got, got all the visible um, imperfections out. Got two coats of uh, uh, eggshell white. And then the wife wanted uh, this to be a textured wall. So we just put this uh, textured paper up. Got three strips of it. And I got a matching on the uh, where the seams are. And then she wanted it painted. We're going to come back and put some black timbers on each of the seams. And it's going to be her accent wall for for doing our videos and uh, here it is 7 30 in the evening it's a very overcast and with this clear ceiling how bright it is in here still so it's like on a normal sunny day there's no need for any type of lighting in fact earlier today it was really sun shining out and I was coming in here just doing some uh, final pieces on the on the wall and it was so bright it was blinding me just off of the reflection of the wall. So this clear ceiling is uh, really excellent for uh, lighting in here. So uh, don't think we'll need even pre in any LED unless she wants to do some evening work. But there we have it. I'll do one more video for a final wrap up and then we should be done.